Hi, this is Ginger from my sister Scrapper. I have a quick little mini album to share with you today. This is a little mini album that I created using my leftover papers from the Bow Bunny Prairie Chic paper collection. I purchased the 12 by 12 um, collection pack. So it's just a small little mini album. I used my cinch to bind it. I tied some seam binding here that's uh, colored with some Tim Holtz Distress Stain. I think this one is Spun Sugar. On the front cover I have some uh, little recollections bling here and here and I add a little doily here that I cut in half and inked around all the edges with walnut stain distress ink. I have some little uh, recollection roses right here, a little leaf that I punched out with a Martha Stewart leaf punch using some of the design paper. Um, this actual prairie chic title is what I cut from the actual label that came from the paper pad. Um, here's a sticker from the sticker sheet and I put it on a scallop circle that I punched out and put on some dimensionals. And I added a little uh, wooden butterfly from Recollections with a little pink pearl in the center. So it measures three and three quarters by four and three quarters. And you open it up, and on the inside here, I went ahead and added a little piece of this pink lace to the side. And I wanted the pink lace just to show a little tiny bit here on the edge, kind of like a little petty skirt would be, anyway. Uh, each one of them is a pocket. I used a decorative edge here on the top here. And this is a Fisker's apron lace punch and they all have a photo mat here and they're plain on the back because I was almost out of paper and then I have some little prima, lee, uh, prima flowers right here with a little pearl bling and at the top I just added a uh, craft tag and then I covered up the little um, red reinforcement hole with some um, little Tim Holtz reinforcements that I got to cover that up so and I might do some stamping on those tags later I'm not sure and you flip it over and I have a little paper clip here and I think this is from Seven Gypsies. Um, again, some more of the design paper and a little photo mat here. Again, some more little premium flowers and a photo mat. This is just the scraps that I had left over and I'm trying to use every little stitch of my paper that I have. Um, I did get quite a bit of stuff out of this though. I got three mini albums and a card. Over here again, I have um, another photo mat, some more of the design paper, some more Prima flowers, um, and a pearl in the center. Again, another tag. On this side, again, another photo mat, a couple more Prima flowers, and some more Prima flowers. Love the wood grain paper, that was my favorite, I think. And love this page too. Again, photo mats are plain. I use craft cardstock from. Hobby Lobby to make the pages. And over here again another Prima flower. Love the rose paper. With the green check. Again another tag at the top. There's five pages in here. And then you flip it over and I have three tiny little Prima flowers here on the back and again a photo mat. And then this piece here is actually from the front sheet that you get inside the collection pack where I cut the title off of. It says Prairie Chic. And then I just went ahead and trimmed this down to fit on the inside cover. I did wrap my chipboard with the design paper and then I have another um, Prima flower here and a little giant bling brad in the middle and I'm not sure where I got those but and then there's the back so there you go that's my little tiny mini album that I created with the leftover papers from the Bow Bunny Prairie Sheet Collection and I did make a little card also as well with the leftovers um, after I got this done I had a, one large piece of paper left on my table so I went ahead and made a, a card. It measures 5 by 8. I have um, some Hobby Lobby flowers here, and some Prima and some Recollection, a Tim Holtz memo pen and I put a button here from Basil. The pearl and some twine. This is a sticker from the sticker sheet. I added some lace to the top of the card and then you open it up and it's plain on the inside. And there's the back. So there you go. That's my projects. Thanks for watching. Bye!